We're using this formation here. This is going to be the same formation that the Blitz is in. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. We get a sack on the very first play. Let's go and let's do this one more time. Like I said, I'm going to try to get the defensive end off this time. Oh my goodness, right past the running back. Like I said, you get pressure on both sides with this play. For the cheapest, fastest, most reliable muck coins on the market, check out my coin sponsors at AOEAH.com and use discount code MONEY for 3% off. Link in the description below. Welcome back, Money Team. This is Mad Money Shot. Sniff out the Mad Cheese as always. Got another gameplay for you guys today. Today, I'm be going over a defense that I've been using a lot and having a lot of success. Whether it's the run or the pass, this defense here is just, it's been very successful for me. You're going to see it in today's gameplay. If you guys want to see more videos like this, as always, hit the like button. Let me know in the comment section. Let's go and let's take a look at my offense real quick. I, I got, I made some upgrades. I got Joey Galloway. I got Reggie Bush. I did that set. The Reggie Bush set got back a lot of Nats. Um, guys like, uh, you know, Brian Dawkins out of my second. Secondary Derek Thomas. I add to my outside linebacker. Speed at outside linebacker is going to be very important for this defensive scheme. It's also going to be important at corner. So Derek Thomas, Von Miller. Uh, I got the full Montez Sweat upgraded, uh, and then my cornerbacks are Marlon Humphrey, J.C. Jackson, and Troll Roll. So I made a lot of improvements. I really like my defense. I probably just got to upgrade my DTs to get it to like a full 88. But I like what I got right now. So this is pretty much the defense. As always, if you guys want to get your mutt team up like mine, check out my coin sponsors AOEAH.com. There's a link in the description below. Every time you use my discount code Money. You help out this channel, you support this channel, so I really appreciate that for all the people that do that. Other than that, let's go and skip right into the gameplay. So, top three cards. I like my new setup, man. I like my new, uh, I like my new defensive setup. I definitely was going cheap on the defense. I'm still going cheap in the offensive line. I have to go out and get some more tackles. If you guys know any like good, not too expensive offensive tackles, let me know in the comment section. I could really use that next. That's about the only thing that my team is missing right now. So he's going with the fullback kick. That's always a, a good sign. <laughs> Gay. On the offensive side, we're going to use a run play scheme that I just put out. It's really only two plays. It's the stretch and the zone week here. I'll have a link in the description for this run play scheme, but it's very good. As you can see right here, very first run play. Oh, bitch, get out the way. We're having a lot of success. We got about 15 plus there uh, before anybody was even close to tackling my boy. It's really just the stretch run here. And uh, this counter run here, that's about it. I mean, it's a very simple scheme. I'll have some pass plays too, but you can see we're just having a ton of success here. So I'm gonna run this a lot. I'm gonna try to get, uh, you know, some ground and pound going here. It looks like he's in a 3-3-5, which is you know, one of the better defenses, but I mean, it's not gonna help with this outside run. See ya. I'm overpowering right now. I have, just have a blocking advantage. I have too many tight ends. He's he's coming out in a small defense. Three plays, I go right down the field. I'm already within, the, within field goal range, but I really like this pass play, the wide trail. Can be very explosive against the right defense if he's in a man coverage. Got that A route coming right over. Oh no! Oh, he almost tagged. He almost snagged that. Man, I thought I had that. I was a good user. I should I should have definitely pump faked or something. You should have been bobbing and weaving. Look at it. So far he's only been in cover three. Two seconds later. No! Dude. Oh my goodness. Wow, he, I think he was in a cover four that time. That's okay though. We're gonna hit him with this mid blitz. Dude, so what why is it what? Wow, dude, that's and that's a flag on me too, which is total nonsense. I gotta say I was off sides. As my opponent rips a big run the opposite way. So yeah, whatever. So we're gonna hit him with some big nickel over G. This is not the defensive play, this is just something I'm kinda messing with. Two seconds later. Oh my goodness, he's going right over the top on me, really? Cover three, one play touchdown. Wow, this guy is already starting to smoke me. So we're gonna go right back to run the ball. We were having success, we just made a mistake. Uh, when we threw it so you know there's nothing really uh no reason to go away from the run because we're having a lot of success with that we need to dial up a cover three play here we go ahead we're gonna hit him with uh the dagger he hasn't seen it yet very hard to stop play so we're gonna try to hit him with this rb route if it's there nope you suck we're gonna go for it fourth and 11 this is never a good decision but i'm doing it i probably should hit the crosser on the last play anyway and the crosser's not really there Oh my goodness, that was tight. All right, we're gonna run it again. Like I said, this play here is successful against just about anything. He's pressing a lot too. So if he's in uh, any you know any kind of defense, I might have success here with the press. Although here, I'm just gonna yeah. make her. Oh, come on, bro. All right, well, yeah, I probably should have just threw that to the tight end. Since he's running cover three, I might as well flip it up and go with the spot play. That Y route's just gonna get wide open against any zone. 
And then sure enough, he's, he's just, you know, these cover threes, they just, these cornerbacks follow those streaks. It's just too easy. Uh, this is one of my favorite formations here too, the wing tight. Like I said, links in the description for all these schemes. This Owen Trap though was not in that scheme. And this Owen Trap is a boss run. Look at that. Boom. Look at that. Oh, I should have went outside. I had a blocker coming on everything. I had Waller coming to the right. This is perfect for 3-3-5. So here's a cover three play. Although I have to take that running back before that. Uh, a cover three play probably wouldn't work in such a tight box. Well, you know what? Let's hit him with the gun split close. This is something where even if the fullback inside is not there, I can just switch over to the PAF slide. I'm going to keep running the ball just because, I mean, I give myself an extra blocker, motion this guy over, try to help me out. And oh my goodness, this dude, he's got screaming heat right now. I had extra blockers over there. All right, cool, fine. We're going to go with the, the PA, PAY slide here, whatever it's called, the PA slide. As you can see right here, I mean, that's, oh, look at that, back of the end zone. Let's go, touchdown. That was tight too, man. He was barely he barely got his feet in there. All right, so tied up. Three minutes left in the second here. So you can see right there, the nickel blitz too. That's the play that I'm going to be focusing on today. We're using this formation here. This is going to be the same formation that the blitz is in. Watch out, watch out, watch out. we get a sack on the very first play i'm gonna hit up some cover two man because i don't like the way he bombed it up on me on that last drive so we're gonna switch in and out between that and the man cover two and now you can see on this next play here everything's pretty much locked up that's right why, gotcha, bitch. why would he go there there was nothing open so we're right back in this game right now two minutes and 20 seconds left we got ball we're gonna run the ball i mean we were having a lot of success running the ball it's good it's a good opportunity to give him the ball back with no time i don't want to score so let's go and let's keep hitting this stretch because he's staying in this cover three. I've had so much success running against this cover three so far. Like, we get in there, we get in there. Oh, man, that was... Nope. So we can either run in here, which, like I said, I don't even care if I punch it in because I just want to kill clock. So we'll, we'll take that. We're down to the one, though. I got a, I got a really good spot there because I thought he, he didn't get that. We're going to go. We're going to switch it up. We're going to go goal line here. Just punch it in. But he's pinching inside, so maybe we can take this outside on the other way. Oh, that's right. Look at that gaping hole. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm sure that was a full run commit and everything, but that was a that was a good audible. So we're gonna go right back to it. Like I said, that's pretty much a two play scheme: cover two man and nickel blitz two. They're both cover two, so the the hope is it doesn't look the same. But I'm just all I'm doing is just bringing this guy down, putting him on a blitz, and then hovering pretty much right over the center guard. Sometimes I'll move over to the center. Sometimes I'll do it over the guard. It's pretty much all she wrote. And you get pressure off of both sides, as you can see right here. I mean, oh my goodness, that pass rush is getting there, and he bare off. Oh, well, that's the thing. I mean, cover two still has a very big weakness there. So that's why you got to switch it up because you really want to switch back and forth. Also still throwing some man blitzes. I'm going to change my zone flats to 25 though so that space isn't there. That's the only thing that I, sometimes I do that. It's not always the best thing to do it, but sometimes I'll do it. If I, if I think he's going to try to take advantage of that spacing, I'll just take it away with 25 yard drops. So here we go once again, trying to get this blitz off the right side. As you can see right there, we're getting some pressure. And then like I said, the flats are there. So that's, that's the choice you got to make. So I'm, I'm going to go right back. And probably take that off. So let's hit him with that blitz one more time. Like I said, this is all I gotta do is bring this guy in, put him on a blitz, and then drop back after the play starts. That's really all it is. Very easy, very easy blitz to set up. Either the cornerback or the defensive end typically gets off on this play here. Uh, he's getting it out pretty quick. So, you know, but we're not giving up much. I mean, he only taking a couple yards. I'll, I'll give that. You know what I'm saying? I'll give that up. I can't do that too much. Obviously, I gotta switch it up. So here, like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it up and take the zone flats off. Just simply going over the top coverage doesn't really take away those those gaps. So here we're gonna go with that uh, that cover two man again. Just like I said, switching it up. Can't can't let him get too comfortable just dotting up my cover two. So I'm gonna switch it up coverage wise. Use the safety a little bit here because that's where all the action is. So I'll just try to take away his deep route so I can keep that three man four man pressure. And that's right. Here. Oh my God, he just mossed me. You've got to be kidding me. The coverage was all over that. I'm going to go cover four quarters. This is a good run defense, too. Oh, my goodness. Wow, that just glitched that out. Damn it! Why were they double covering the outside receiver? Both of those defenders were just standing around when that guy was right up the scene. Apparently, that verticals play is really glitchy because he that's the only play he's scored with right now. All right, so we're doing it one more time. Like I said, we got to get this pressure. we got to get this heat. Now, we didn't get the full setup in there, but like I said, boom, you got that cover too. You're going to stop those outside runs. It's going to stop outside runs naturally. Inside runs, not necessarily the case. So let's go and let's do this one more time. Like I said, I'm going to try to get the defensive end off this time. Oh my goodness, right past the running back. Like I said, you get pressure on both sides with this play. That was fast. All right, he's got a punt, so we shut him down. All right, so we're starting off with great field position, too, because of that. I said this this destroys cover three, although I'm not really sure if he's still in that. Looks like he's in a cover four quarters the way he's pressing. What? 
Doesn't matter though. Oh, let's get outside of that. Oh my goodness, dude. Reggie Bush should feel faster. He should feel broken. He's the best running back in the game. Look, he's gotta be in cover four. Cover four is gonna be the best defense for this. And we got him biting. We got him biting. Fight. That's right. Oh my goodness, that truck. That was a man zero. So like I said, I was expecting that at some point. It's kind of the meta defense. So let's go ahead and let's hit him with this uh, the stretch again. Oh, that man car. Oh, the man corner's out there. Oh my goodness, I couldn't quite get around him. We have the wide receiver out. If he's gonna be a man coverage. I, I can just cook him with the speed, the speed out here on the X. I don't know if it's to add a depth that I can score, but I know I can get close. Nope. Oh my goodness, we couldn't turn up field. There was nobody there. All right, we're at the one again. We've scored so many times with this. We might as well go back to this. Full back inside combo. He's playing with one of the better defenses in the game, and I'm playing with what I think is one of the better defenses in the game. Nope. As he shuts me down again. So third and goal. We gotta go right back to that slide. Go ahead and hurry up on him. Keep him in this. I don't want to throw an interception. That's the, that's the thing. Like I, I don't want to throw another red zone pick. Oh my gosh! Bruh. The he, he I don't know what he just sent. I know a lot of people probably think I should go for this, but I just want the lead. I mean, I I, I feel like I feel like my defense can shut him down. So we're just gonna take the lead. Bring him right back. The pressure, I feel like the pressure was getting there. I gotta get sacked. So we're gonna go right back to Nickel Blitz too. Let's get that pressure. Let's get let's get him second and 20 or something like that. So like I said, all you gotta do is bring this guy down, guess pass. And that's probably the weak the one weakness of his defense. Is it is weak to inside runs. So I can't necessarily do it against that. So I'll go ahead and I'll add a cover four into the uh in the you know just in case he wants to run a lot so now i got to cover for the cover for safety's play to run much better so if he's going to run the ball we have something for that and i think he might have recognized it because he switched out to the it looks like he's in the tight now probably should have switched to the cover too but i don't know if i have enough time so we're just going to use all this out here uh there's nothing really there buddy there's nothing really there go ahead get after him get after him get after him nope Oh, okay. That was my guy. And oh, I didn't even tackle him. Okay, so he didn't get much. Did he get a yard there at all? Did he lose yards? All right, so like I said, we're going right back. We're going right back to that cover two. I like the base of the line and press, which can be an issue. But, you know, with the pressure getting in like this, it's not really going to matter. So here we go. Let's see if that defensive end or that cornerback off. They're both coming off. Oh, the cornerback. Oh, my Ooh. God. I was so close. Wow. I was close on the sack and I was close on the coverage. So back to that blitz. Like I said, we got to get that pressure. And like I said, it's going to be weak to inside zones because the safeties play back. But you know what? That's not huge right now. It's really just a guessing game between the cover two and the cover four. We're going to switch it up though. We're going to go full pressure here. We're going to send the house. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. We got that instant pressure. So I had to get a loss of down there. I had to do something. All right, so we're going right back to this. Uh, we're going to do some more man blitzes. We're just going to switch up formation. So hopefully he doesn't realize that it's a different man blitz. He's making a lot of adjustments. I don't know what he's got going on. He's making a lot of adjustments. It's got to be a pass play. Hopefully we get this heat off the backside here. Oh, he motioned the guy last second. That's not good. I have to recover this running back now. Oh, and he ran out of time. Sucker. That's a Daniel Jones type of move right there. I'll probably make that motion again. So I got to be aware of that. Okay, he made a different motion. All right, that's fine. As long as there's a motion of the guy across. So we're going to press. We're going to get this heat in quick. So we're going to press. I can drop back into coverage. Running back does go out on a route. Oh, he's got <gasps> Max Pro. My goodness. I expect him to run the ball a little bit now. So we're going to go cover four. He's got to run the ball. He's got to want to run clock. And he does. And that doesn't stop it anyway. Oh, my goodness. I almost gave him a touchdown. All right. So back in that cover four. Like I said, he's got to run the ball. That's got to be his game plan right now. Because I'm pretty sure that he thinks he can just run out clock and give me the ball with no time. At least that's what I would be thinking. So I'm gonna not. I'm not. I'm not gonna take those chances. So we're not going full blitz version here, though. We're just gonna run this regular because I expect run. And it wasn't. <laughs> Nothing's really open, is it? Either. Let's go. We got a. Oh my goodness. Coverage sack. That's what I'm talking about. Second and twenty. Oh, second and twenty-six. It's going with a hurry up. I don't think I'm gonna set this up. Oh my goodness. Are we gonna get this set up in? Yes, we do. Oh. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Let's go. We are going to the house with this. No, he definitely don't have the, the, the steam for that. He runs out of steam. I tried to like truck him from in front of him. And that might be game. I, I mean, oh, he's really going to quit. 
Dude had three timeouts left. He's really going to quit down three. I mean, I get it. That's frustrating, but I'll take it. So if you guys want to see more game players, more defensive plays in general, hit the like button. Let me know in the comment section. Other than that, thanks for watching Mad Money Shit Out. Need more help or just want to show your support? Then head over to my Patreon and join my team, where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays, as well as early access to my vids and more. Link in the description below. Thank you.